Yo, Konnichiwa, Jess here with episode 2, Planets. I actually still don't fully know if that's how you pronounce it, because there's an extra E at the end. So it's Planetes, or something like that, I don't know. But I'm gonna pronounce it Planets for now, until I figure that out. But, um, well, I know what it's about, what it's about now. Just a team of people who collect space junk. And they're like the lowest of the astronaut groups. Which I don't see why. That seems very. That seems like a very important job, to, to to clear that shit so you can even do space travel. Like, that seems important. So let's watch this one now. Let's see what this episode brings. Cause the last one was beautiful. That ending, with those visuals, that was beautiful. All right, and in three, two, one, begin. I love. Whoa, this is loud. is a very serious threat. Yeah, it's become a huge threat, but they're not, the people doing it aren't that important. <laughs> it's just silly. What's this guy doing? Panicking, yeah. I mean, that would be terrifying. Oh, I bet that's gonna cause a big accident now. Oh, intro. All those ancient writings in the background. It's a very chill intro. Oh, look at that. That's cool. I like how they do that. That was really cool. I like where this intro just got. Very calming. We humans sure are incredible. <laughs> I feel like that's like the moral of this story is like how incredible we are. Like a dream phase two. <clears throat> what was that? <laughs> Why was I dancing with them? Oh, I thought he was serious. I was like, what? They're just going to start the episode like that? Oh, it's a luck dance. <laughs> underneath your nose <laughs> I gotta have a pen somewhere no I'm not gonna join this, this is ridiculous <laughs> all 
I want to. Four. Oh, bogus. <laughs> An ancient sacrifice. Why am I playing the lottery? Oh, uh, okay. Yeah, I mean, who? You play the lottery to win money. That's it? <laughs> He's got ideas at least. She forgot. <laughs> oh yeah! <laughs> just grabs her head. <laughs> that was smooth. Hey, handsome. <laughs> Where are you going to? <laughs> See how he caught her? Mademoiselle. Uh huh. I got you. Don't you worry. Um. <laughs> Yeah, I just don't have the balls to live in a fucking space station. There's no way. Wait, what are those? The box has a bomb on it. Oh, they were lottery, lottery tickets. <laughs> the lottery's a scam. <laughs> <laughs> Still can't do it.
about time. <laughs> Someone won the lottery? Is it ship's captain? Oh, I thought somebody won the lottery. He's a little salty about that. At least he pretended to be happy in front of the guy. That guy's not afraid to speak his mind, is he? She's still not ready for. Whoa! Look at him go! <laughs> Boom! That was a Lu that was a Luigi move in Super Smash Bros. I love this. I love how they do that. That looks so cool. Oh, he's that rookie in the beginning. Okay. I didn't catch that.
Yeah, he doesn't need to hear that right now. He he learned his lesson. He picked all sevens. That guy's voice actor is ridiculous. This is getting serious. The man is broken. It's interesting advice. Yeah, this is the same thing he didn't destroy last time, right? I know all about it. Yeah, if you touch it, it'll evade you. How ironic. Meet up with this thing again. <laughs> Excuse me. There it goes. That'd be terrifying. Oh, I can never, ever, ever trust those wires. I could, yeah? Bada boom, bada bing. Look at that. Look at that. Is she about to float away? Wait, wait, someone just broke free. Oh, dude.
Dude, this is shitty. Okay, the suspense is killing me now. I actually, I'm wondering if he's actually gonna do it. <laughs> Let's pray. <laughs> God, that'd be terrifying. First job. <laughs> First day on the job. How is it? Yo. Was intense. <laughs> All right, I fucking did it. Five years. <laughs> Letter of apology. Oh yeah, because they she it was technically their fault for getting in their way in the first place. But he still saved them. I remember this outro. I liked it. I really liked this outro. It reminds me of something. Of another... I don't know. It reminds me of another anime. But I cannot put my finger on it. It's nostalgic for no reason. <laughs> you know? <laughs> I like this, dude. Is that it? Yep, next thing. Okay, that's it. I like this. I like this anime. I really do. It is like a slice of life. I, when I was told that, I was like, but it's in space about astronauts. How could it be? It is. It's just if, like, the world was, like, what am I trying to say? Ugh. Oh. The world's developed enough to where people go into space all the time. That's what I was trying to say. There we go. And that's the slice of life with that part of life already. It's just fucking awesome. This is interesting. That last part was it intense. 
I legit was a little worried. <laughs> I didn't know what to expect. Uh, <laughs> animes can change just like that. I mean, you think somebody's a main character and then like two or three episodes in, <laughs> motherfucker's dead. <sighs> you just don't see it coming, so. He survived, they survived. <laughs> that was intense, I'm not gonna lie. Oh, man, I really do though. I really like this. It's really just a really chill, I could just see this, see myself watching this, sitting down, making some popcorn, having the next 20 minutes to myself, you know, watch this and just chill out. Maybe smoke a little bit. I fucking like this. But I gotta get to work. <laughs> My, other than YouTube, I gotta get I'll be late to work. Okay, thanks for watching, everybody. If you enjoyed the video, go ahead and smash that fucking like button. Subscribe if you wanna see any more, and of course, Comment anything on your fucking mind because I'm on the fucking air. Thanks, this is Mr. Jazz. I'm Jazz or Salma. Or just whatever you want to call me. I'm out. See you next time.